That was nice. Hi there, sports fan. Aren't you gonna? There she goes. Yeah. Alright, today we have a we have a we have an extra special guest. Oh, <laughs> this is Bill Beckling. Let's give him a hand. Thank, Thank you. you. Don't Stand clap up. too hard. You'll rehearse. Oh, hurt the other hand. Uh, Bill. Bill is a. Uh, Thank you. Bill, rambunctious audience today. <laughs> then, then we have an interview with a young lady who's a uh, athlete and uh, also a cheerleader at uh, Maynard High School in beautiful Maynard, yeah, Massachusetts, for those of you watching it in uh, Honolulu. Right? <laughs> and uh, then we have, uh, as a return visit, they're laughing again at us on the other side. We have a return visit. There he is. Say hello. Matt Cabanella, let's give hey. Matt a hand. All right, all right, all right, all right. Matt's going to play outside in the rain with electric guitar. Thanks, right. Ed. Okay. So, uh, this is, and then we have Nikki Penta. Nikki? And the we, one uh, and only. All right. So, why don't we do a quick a quick quiz? All right? Go for it. Oh, God. Big fun. <laughs> all right. We have an audience of three. Let's hear from the audience. Come on. Uh, uh, what's the matter? You can't clap? You just heckle? All right. Good. Thank you. <laughs> Killing minutes here for nothing. All right, the, the answer, you can phone a friend, Bill, and the, yeah, go ahead. The answers, most, usually they're in the question. All right, so you ready? Not always. Multiple I'm, choice. I'm ready. Right. Multiple choice. We gotta get you on. I'm ready. The president of France is A, multiple choice, French, B, Spanish, C, Tahitian, yeah. or D, German, it's the president of France. I'll go for French. See that, there's your thing. Let's give him a hand. Yay, Whoa. all right. I'm like audience participation. <laughs> okay, that's enough. Thank you. Don't hurt your hand. All right, Matt. What what month follows to August? You ready? A May. These are tough. B June. C July or D September. September. Yeah. Hey. All right. All right. You ready? Oh sure. What? Beth Midler out there. Which object is the largest? You ready? <laughs> Watch it. A baseball, A, B, a football, C, an apple, D, Humpty Dumpty. What? Just answer the question, please. Is Humpty Dumpty cracked up? Well, is he cracked or is he together? It doesn't matter. He's it does. He's Have you seen the commercials? In that case, okay, he's larger. Thank you. He's so not... it would be D. Thank you. This audience is great. I, mean, I don't know what to do with them. All right, number four. It's a new car. I'll give you a new car, a hearse. All right. What, That's your ride. What state? You ready? I'm what ready. What state in in? Are you ready? I can't read. What state in the southern U.S. begins with the letter A? Ready? A. Maine. Kevin. Uh, yeah. B. Thank you. B. Florida. C. Alabama. And D, who cares? I'm going to go with Alabama. Are you really? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> what a group. What a group. <laughs> Gag me with a spoon, I'll tell you. All right. A ba all right. Who's up, Matt? A baseball bat uh -oh. is made out of A. You're listening? <laughs> Dried flowers. I'll put that. Oh, this is my favorite. B, permanent pressed fabric. C oh, no, here's my favorite. C, veal cannelloni, which is close to... Cabanello, or D. Wood? Uh, I, I believe it's Wood. Thank you. Give them, all right, we have five for five. What a, what a friendly group we have here today. <laughs> all right, uh, oh, all right, you. Well, if I want a seal, I'll get one. Thank you. <laughs> all right, so let's go over to Bill Beckling. Bill? Yes. Bill was in the 1956 Olympics in Melbourne. Now, most people, I don't think, know where Melbourne is. Now, is it the one in Florida or the real one? It's the one hidden under the bottom of the earth. Oh, Brooklyn. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Melbourne, Australia. Okay. And that was in 1956. You, were, you graduated Yale in what? 1958. Close enough. And uh, did you get a new Chevy or what? No. You drove it to the <laughs> levee? And, uh, all right. So uh, you were on the crew team, right? I was the coxswain of the Yale varsity hey, it's crew. It's a family show, Bill. Let's not go there. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. And uh, you were the one with, show them the megaphone. Or the well, other. I have the megaphone here. Really? That's why right I asked here. you to show I it. I do, I have it right you here. Have to, you put that strap in your teeth, right, and then try to yell. You actually put it, put it on your head like this, yeah. Yeah, back then there were no electronics in the boat. Of course not. So you had to yell very loudly so people could hear you. Now, 
all the coxswains have a microphone? microphone and an amplifier so they can whisper to the crew. If you don't I like it, you get the water on it, right? It's electric. It even works if it gets wet. <laughs> yeah, but he gets electrocuted. Yeah. Or she. All right. <laughs> so you want to, can you hold up your medal? You want to do that? And I thought you were probably going to ask that, so I put it in a convenient pocket. So, yes, here's the medal. <laughs> here's the medal. I can't get the package open here. Oh, you're gonna, what there adjective were you going to use? Ah, ah. There it is. Now, there's a room in it. You got this off of eBay. Is that true? <laughs> People keep asking me if this is a replica. No, this is the real thing. Can you bite on that thing and break your I'm not no. going to bite it. But it's not real gold, right? It's silver plated. Uh, it's silver plated with gold. What are they now? Are they real now? No. And they're all different. Every, every uh, country uh, no. makes really? its own metal. Great. And back in 56, there was no lanyard. Everyone says, why don't you hang it on your neck? This is just the way it came, handed to me on the dock when we came off the, the bay. Water. Was the dock? I was on a lake. Hit it, dock of the bay. <laughs> all right. So, uh, so, all right. So you did that, and you were still at Yale. I was, a sophomore, yep. Okay, that would explain why you graduated two years yeah, later. Exactly right. But your other claim, <laughs> thank you, come on, come on. But, yeah, all right, all right, let's give him a hand, get the hook. No. But your other claim to fame car. is, what? <laughs> but your other, a new car, yeah. Your other claim to fame is that uh, you, you, uh, you got, uh, yes, sir, you, uh, you got an electrical engineering degree, but you became a nuclear engineer. I worked in nuclear engineering, yes. Yes, and who did you work with? I worked on the staff of Admiral Hyman Rickover. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Thank, no, thank you. <laughs> and he, was he the first one to work with this stuff? Or? He is known as the father of the nuclear submarine. And who was the mother? Oh, uh, I never looked into that. Never looked <laughs> into that. I mean, she must be. If there was a baby, there had to be something. <laughs> yeah. Unless it was a. The baby um, was the Nautilus, the first nuclear submarine. I that was the baby. In, I had one of those in my bathtub. You put the little stuff in there, it would go puff, puff, puff. That's right. And then sink. <laughs> Good. Are you the one who designed it with a cork at the bottom that could not be removed? No, that, that, that we did not develop that one. All right. So what, how long were you in nuclear energy? I worked for the Admiral for eight years. Eight years? Yeah. How long was he there? He was actually the longest serving Admiral in the history of the United States Navy. I would like to point out that this is evading the question. <laughs> <laughs> how old was he? Yeah, no, not how old was he. How, how long, long was he in the Navy? That's very good. I think he was in the Navy. Hold on, I can add this up. He was born in 1900. He died in 86. He entered the Naval Academy in 1920. So he was in the Navy for 66 years. But how long was he with the nuclear energy? Uh, mm -hmm. He started the nuclear program in 1946. So he was 40 years in the nuclear program. Let's give him a hand there. I'm sure he'll be uh, yeah. really. Uh, I just do it hard, but give me five, baby. No, that's how I got into <laughs> <ended. laughs> it. <laughs> Never hit a three-point shot at Dunkin' Donuts, a yes. sponsor. Right. Never hit it because you go for you go for high fives, and some guy missed my hand and went bang there. Yeah, I'll tell you, it was really big. This five-year-old kid. <laughs> Oh, hi, Nikki. Oh, hi. Uh, Nikki, Nikki. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, is there anything else to talk, to talk about yourself? You have a wonderful Well, handy. you've already hit the two high points of my life. What oh, else how is about there? some low points? <laughs> <laughs> Any low points here? Yeah, yeah. By the way, I, what is this? You rowing or something? Oh, you do skiing also. I, uh, yes, yes. Now, don't mention where, because that's not a sponsor. It's in Westford. Oh, good. Oh, right At on least, 495. No, it's on. Uh, we know a power or powers road. That's close enough. I think, yeah. That's that close. Powers road, we have a right? dog back here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. Can you roll over too, Kevin? All right. Uh, I'd like to announce that I, uh, I have a website, and because uh, I have MC, not MC Hammer, to be confused with that. You know, yeah. MC for hire, right here, <laughs> and uh, I have ads out, and uh, they're in the uh, where? Oh, they're in the Acton Boxborough. Uh, Weekly newspaper right now, and next week they'll be in the Lexington Minuteman, which is a, uh, they're having a big push next week. 12,500 uh, papers are going to every household. Yeah, imagine, uh, folks, if you play your cards right, you can get all of this. That's right, all of this, baby. <laughs> I'll pop it. Thank you, thank you, audience. Thank you, <laughs> thank you. We have reasonable rates. We always like to say that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And I am available. I mean, I can work fit it cheap. in. I can work. I don't work cheap. <laughs> all right. Business are you talking about? <laughs> no, but I mean you'll have a great time. I don't. We do. We do everything. We do. I believe you. You might Thank not you. want to advertise that in the newspaper. We do everything. No, I got everything <laughs> in there. All right. So, is there anything else you'd like to add? Is there anything else you'd like to ask? 
No, not at the moment. Okay. Okay, thank you. <laughs> I'll call you tonight at midnight. <laughs> All right, now we're going to break for a, uh, a uh, roughly 10-minute interview with a young lady named Roxy Pinson. Let's give Roxy a hand. All right, all right, all right. Will you wake up? Come on. If you saw Roxy, you'd be applauding. Come on now. Yeah. All right. All right, Kevin, you're under arrest. Okay. She goes to Maynard uh, High School, which I believe is in Maynard, Mass. Is that correct? Uh, I would think so. Thank you. He's from Concord. He doesn't know. <laughs> <laughs> stuck over there. With okay. Uh, so make, make a note. Don't advertise it. No. I'll advertise anywhere. I don't care. All right. And that, that, so she's an extraordinary cheerleader and also an athlete. Okay. We're here with Roxy Pinson. Uh, Roxy, not Roxanne, right? Just Roxy. Just, yes. Okay. Yeah. And Roxy goes to uh, Menard High School in Maynard. Maynard, Maynard yeah. Mass. And, and you're in what grade now? The 15th? Ninth. <laughs> Ninth grade. Yeah. I'm 15. You're 15? Yeah. So am I. Oh, yeah. Give or take a little. In dog ears. Ooh. <laughs> wow. One Just nothing guess. <laughs> All right. So uh, you, your claim to fame is you're a cheerleader, right? Yeah. Did we mention you're in the ninth grade? Yeah. I can't remember. So you're, you're a cheerleader. I'm yeah. glad it says to, well, okay, the clock is off, but that's all right. Okay. So uh, what, what are you, are you cheerleading right now? No, I cheerlead in the, the fall and like it starts in the summer, but. Huh? <laughs> what do you do to football? Well, we cheer for the football players. They don't need it. I know. What, well, what, what do you do, basketball? No? No, they don't have a basketball team. That would, why not? They got know. a football team but no basketball? Yeah, they used to have a basketball team. What happened? They were no good? N not many people did it, the girls. Oh, girls? I know, like girl cheerleaders. Like they didn't, not, not many people not? did it. I don't know. So you don't leap, that's all. Yeah. <laughs> you stand there. So you, uh, but they have a basketball team. Yeah. Hmm. They won the state finals Let's this year. Let's not push it. Okay. No, they're, they're, just kidding. They're, 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 what about the uh, hockey team? They have a hockey team? Um, I think we have a hockey team with another town, but I don't really follow that. Okay, good. You heard it here first, folks. Well, thank you. <laughs> Very informative. And so, what other? You, you, so you do the you do the football. Mm -hmm. So what's the summer? You have to practice and pass out on the field. Yeah, the well, <laughs> we like run around. We like run a mile every practice, and then we just like practice I, the stunts and stuff like that. I could drive a mile around the field. Oh yeah. You have to run in the heat. Yeah. But you're just jumping up and down. What's I don't know the point of it, just to like get in shape, I guess. Masochistic coach. Yeah. That's all. She yeah, she doesn't run it with us. So. Of course not, because she I can't. Know. I know. She's over there with the <laughs> drink. So that and uh, so what uh, what else do you do? You run on track too? Yeah, I run track and I play softball. When's the track season? Um, it's in spring. It's right now. Ah. But this year I'm not doing it. Why? Because softball instead. In. There you go. Does, does everybody know that? Yeah. Now they do. And how many games is a softball season? Um, depends Man, on 15. if we go farther. Like no, but even a regular season. Oh. Yeah, I think ten. That's all. Yeah. When's it start? You haven't been able to, you haven't been able to practice outside lately. We, no, yeah, no. Well, actually, we practiced yesterday outside because it was like kind of fifties. <laughs> 50s. Yesterday it was in, dropped to the 20s. Oh wait, the oh. day before that then. Very good. Yeah, it was in a. Oh yeah, well, it made the low yeah. 50s. Yeah, it wasn't exactly muggy. No. All right. So you you. So uh, so what position do you play? Um, I can play anywhere, but like I'm not that good of a pitcher. But so we haven't got our positions yet. But um, I can so, like play anywhere. What would you like to play? Um, third base. But I like the field. Third base. Huh? Yeah. You get you have insurance policy paid up. Third Not base yet. is called the hot corner for a good reason. Really? Yeah, I didn't even know that. The, the, that's what they call it. The balls oh. come down there real fast. It's not yeah. as bad at first. Yeah, but then, I, f like, I don't like first because then people throw you the ball all the time. Well, it's because they want to make the out. Yeah, I know. Why. But then, like, they're, like, really fast throws. I'm like, ah! Well, you let it bounce in the dirt and blame I it know. on the throw. Yeah. That's the guy who threw it. But third base is terrible. What about if you got a charge on a bunt? Some of these turkeys will swing away. Because in your case, it would be a turkette, right? Yeah. <laughs> they swing away, you get a line drive at you. Then I'll catch it. And if I don't? Yeah, you'll catch it right about here. Yeah. yeah. Then but then you got to throw over the first. Long throws, some of those. It's okay. I got a good arm. Modest, too. I see your father does, too, because he has 
coffee. Yeah, I was a yeah. 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 All right. So, well, your father uh, he, he enjoys it, right? Coffee. Dunkin' Donuts. He enjoys Donuts. coffee. He enjoys being at Dunkin' Donuts. Yeah. He doesn't like coffee though, but. What does he drink? Coke, Mountain Dew, soda all the time. Caffeine. Yeah, he's obsessed. Does he take it internally? He takes it intravenously. Well, it's caffeine. <laughs> so what? What are some of the uh, uh, subjects you take? Um, English, math, That's Spanish. That's overrated English. I know. What? What kind of math? Um, algebra. Right now. Ooh. Yeah. You're, you're doing well with that. Yeah, I'm pretty good at it. Damn. What? I'm available. Oh. And then. I taught algebra. You did? Yeah. Oh, well, I'm mm. good at it. Hmm? I'm good at it. Oh, well, well, fake it. Okay. Um, and then we take physics, which is really hard. That's a pain. Yeah. Nobody uses it. I don't. I know. No one. I know. Who cares? About I know. I don't then, want to know about mechanical thing. As long as it works, when I turn the key on in a car, I don't care what's going on. I know. And then Spanish. Um, like, I'm bad. Just I don't even know. Like I know like the basics, but I I suck. What? Oh, good. Yeah. Why? Why? Uh, why Spanish? <laughs> Um, I don't know. It's like, why do we take it or why do I don't like it? Why do you take it? I don't know. They think we're going to need it. You're forced? You're not. Everything's translated. Yeah, I know. We have to like take... You have to take a language? Yeah, we have to take like... Probably you want to take English twice. A few twice. years. I know. <laughs> and then you can like stop it though after like a certain amount of years. Yeah, 15. Yeah. You have to take German because they take the, pre the verbs, they look alike and they have a prefix on them and they're all at the mm -hmm. end of the sentence. Oh. Very nice. Our only option is Spanish. Oh, well then don't take German. Why? They don't have a... That, that's not an option. I know. Yeah, our own, yeah we're forced to Complain. take that. Complain. Okay, so do you, uh, I think we're approaching the 10 minute mark. Oh, no, we're not. We have loads of time here. Oh. So, what else? What do you like to do? <laughs> what, do, you like? What, what, do you, what else do you do? Hmm. Besides flicking your hair a lot. What the heck else yeah, do you do? Yeah, I don't know. I'm obsessed with that. Are you, I don't because, uh, you know. Yeah. I don't flick Um. Yes. Well, mm -hmm. I like to go to the beach in the summer. Well, well, no, in the winter. Yeah. A lot of space. Um, in Your the winter. Your father notice. Hmm. Do you like to go to the beach? Yeah. He knows he doesn't like to go to the beach. I don't either. Oh, why not? Be burnt to a crisp. Yeah. So, so does my dad. Um, let me think. I like to play in the snow in the winter. Yeah. And you like to help old people. That was remember that stuff for. <laughs> they had they had a uh, beauty contest. I like to hold, old, help old people. Thank you. <laughs> That's what they would say. Oh my gosh. Uh, right? That's what they would say. Ridiculous. So what um, else? Hmm. Well, for a job, I used to work at McDonald's. Oh, that's great. Hey, here's your burger. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's just like my dad. But yeah. Um, but then I stopped working there. Like I told him I'm taking a break from basically just like not going back for a while. Like. I don't know, they said I could take a break, so then I haven't been back since like the summer. Well, that's a break. Yeah, and so then... a long one. I know, I might go back in the summer, but I hate working there. Oh, it's air condition. True, yeah. true. But like, I don't know, in the summer it also gets hot, because like, the window's always open in the drive through and so yeah. A little nippy. Yeah. Of course, this winter it wasn't bad. Yeah, I know. Could have gone to the beach on some of those days. Yeah. Except stay out of the water. I wish. And then so I what babysit. The, uh, what, what did you do at... Uh, McDonald. Um, They're not a sponsor. Should we be talking about this? No. What <laughs> else do you do with it? Um, I would just like give out people's food and like take people's orders and stuff like that. Oh, terrible. Yeah. yeah, what do you want, right? I know. And then some people would be like so rude. Of course. Yeah, I know. This is America. <laughs> yeah. And then. Where was yeah. this? Maynard. I was going to say Menard. Yeah. Where's that on 27? The McDonald's? Uh. Yeah, it's down Main Street. Is that 27? I think. Do you do volunteer work? We have a question from the audience. Jets, do you do volunteer work? Um, no, I haven't. Oh, well, you should get into volunteer work. <laughs> you heard like, it here first. <laughs> like what? Volunteer with what? Well, Could be a uh, candy striper, in right? town, there's a food pantry. And oh. You go there and hand Senior out center, probably. The if they meat. have it. What? Uh -huh. If they have a pantry at... I don't know if they have one. Do they in Maynard? I don't know. Each town. You have to check with the town. Oh. Well, you can do a, a candy striper over at uh, What's Emerson. What's that? You run around with a candy striper. You know, really? red and, uh, vertical red and white, right? 
And you do, you can, it depends on what group you're in. Well, give her, give her some. Well, well. well, the thing is, there's a long waiting. Oh, oh yeah, but, uh, but, 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 but your father works nearby. You can bring coffee. That'll move you up the way. Oh, yeah. So you could, uh, you could do that. You can do that in the summer. Okay. Oh. Is, that, is that mommy? Come on in here, mommy. We're running out of time. Get in here, mommy. I said get in here. Oh, my gosh. No, you don't want to come in? Oh, all right. He's we have 11 seconds, Mary. Well, I want to. Mary, we have 11 there. seconds. Time out, Kansas City. We, uh, I want to. I want to thank you for coming down. Yeah, thank you for having me. No, no, no. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> all right. Anybody? Your mother didn't show. Up. I mean, she didn't come up. <laughs> oh no. All right. That's Roxy Pinson. Let's give her a hand. Yay. Hey. <laughs> there you go. Oh my God. <laughs> there you're on. All right. That'd be April. Okay. So now, wake up, Matt. You're coming on now. Do you have anything to say, Becky? No. Becky? What the really? Your name? <laughs> yeah, okay. Do you have anything to say there? No. You want to announce what yeah, you're doing? No. Say okay. Nice and, you know, Calm down. You're running out of time. All right. Do you, nothing? <laughs> no. You've done a great job. Thank you. I don't know if we can handle it without you. Yeah, I think you'll be all right. Okay. You want to be a hostess? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> what a host. Well, no. You get to meet me. Kevin, you're on. All right. Okay, Joe, what are you going to do today? Uh, oh, by the way, he's my, doing that's a, a seal over there. Okay, good. He's got now. You notice uh, he's he added a harmonica here. Yeah, it's in, yeah. I got a brush. Good. My he, teeth. he he's an English teacher. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And I love the I love the shape you got. Okay. All right. Go ahead. <laughs> can, can I use that on my hair? A head? Go ahead. Go ahead. You're on. <laughs> you on your eyebrows, man. You <laughs> 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 Jeez, what does it say host gets hit? <laughs> You know my mother never loved me You know my father was a drunk You know the preacher tried to tell me some Boy, don't ever play with guns But I made a deal All down in New Orleans, yeah But Pedro tried to stick me, so I shot him in the knees. And Sheriff Brown came through that door. He said, boy, you better freeze. No, I'm going down. No, down to Mexico, yeah. Because you won't find me hanging from no tree. Not today, brother. Sheriff Brown, he chased me down all to the county line. And I ran as fast as I could. I got the cocaine on my mind. Yeah, I'm going down. Not right down to Mexico. Cause you won't find me hanging from no you. Tree. 
All right, yeah. All right. Uh, okay. All right. Give me a hand. Come on now. Give me a hand now. Kevin. Kevin. Give me, stand up and give me another hand. Come on now. Here, I, here. I'm doing the best I can. All right. Okay. I'd just like to make a quick announcement. That unfortunately, today, this is the, uh, the 6th of April. Huh? Mm -hmm. Don Rickles died today of uh, kidney failure at his home in Los Angeles. May 8th, he would have been 91 years old. And by the way, he was a pussycat. That was all an act. We both went to the same high school. What high school was that? Thank you, you forgot. Newtown High School. High school? High school in Queens, New York, baby. All right, let's hear that. There you go. He was 20 years before me, roughly, because I'm only 35. Okay, no, all right, that, actually, that's a sad note. It's a pussycat. All right, uh, wake up, please. Yo. <laughs> Yo, Brooklyn, Queens, New York. Yo, baby, yo, Yo. man, baby. That's I'd hit good. this hand with you, but I get hurt. All right, what, uh, what, uh, what's the next number? Hanging down make in the barbershop with my boys from Queens. I don't know what you said, but I'm going to hit you with that. <laughs> <laughs> what do you, what do you want to do now? What's your, it's called What You're Going to Do. It's, it's well, how long? Can you give it? We only got 132 left. Uh, we can, you in pain? Oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> we can bring you back next week, two weeks from today. I can, I can play a song. I can play. I'll play I can, anything I can you see want. the timer. Can I, I'll just make it up as I go. That'd be cool. I tried that and I was arrested. Don't do that. Uh, Not really. I don't want to say that. Conquered it. <laughs> I was sitting on a TV screen and I was saying, man, nothing gets any better than you and me. Yeah, you know that we're from Queens. And I was riding this time clock that that rabbit used to hold. You know that rabbit never did grow old. We didn't find a rabbit in Queens. <laughs> Cause they came out of different boroughs. But you know they had the same story to tell. Yeah, they came from Brooklyn. talking about Alice and a boyfriend from the Navy Yards. Oh, and he never did come back from that old school. She was full of shards. And we only got nine seconds, but I think, baby, uh, we could go to the schoolyard. Hey! We'll see y'all. We'll see y'all. Okay, my thank you. Okay, Southern accent. I'll see y'all. We'll see everybody here. Are you coming back? You come back now. You here? In two, <laughs> the hair will fall off. We'll come back. There's the closing thing. And we'll so come back in two weeks. Cold. All right. You want to come back again? And when it comes. Yeah, to I, I really want to come back. <laughs> yeah, he's really here. He's on the His money's on the Mets, which goes to show that Eddie Joe always bets his heart. You'll hear a slick review or two from Nikki. And Cantor something Berg will sing some song. There's weather news and schtick, enough to make you sick. You'll be glad you came along.